divide double three nine one by three. While doing this division, many do this mistake. What is the mistake that they do? I will let you know. But before that, we should frame it in this way. Double three nine one and three here. This is your step one. Next, here we have three and three here. When do we get three in three table? Three ones three. Now we should subtract. We get zero. After this, bring down the beside number. So three down. When do we get three in three table? Three ones three. Now we should subtract. We get zero. After this, bring down the beside number. So nine down. When do we get nine in three table? Three three is nine. Now we should subtract. We get zero. After this, bring down the beside number. So one down. After this step, the mistake happens, and the mistake is this. Here we have one, and here three. One is smaller than three. So what many do is they directly put dot take zero, which is wrong. Why is it wrong? Because just now you brought this number down, and in the same step you want to put dot take zero, which is wrong. I repeat, bring down the number, and also put dot take zero. Bring down the number and put dot take zero. Both at the same step, you should not do. Instead of that, what you should think of doing is, which number should we take here? If I take one, we will get three. But three is larger than one. So what we should do is, we should take zero. So three into zero, zero. Now we should subtract. We get one. Over here, we did not bring any number down, and one is smaller than three. So now we can put dot and take zero. So ten. A number close to ten in three table is three three is nine. Now we should subtract. We got one again. That means we get bar on this number. Did you understand where does the mistake happens? You should not do that mistake.